I'm Dr. Karen Lyon. I am the executive director and CEO of the Louisiana State Board of Nursing. The concern that, that we had when we read the bill was that it's, it's limited to nurse practitioners. So we have four categories of advanced practice RNs, all of whom ca can get prescriptive authority, control substance authority, and um, uh, would be able to recommend, but they weren't listed in nurse practitioners, so I assume that the legislature wanted to limit it to nurse practitioners. That may become problematic for our psych mental health clinical nurse specialists and our adult geriatric clinical nurse specialists who also treat patients who also have prescriptive authority and control substance authority. I don't know how our nurse practitioners are going to be able to recommend when the conditions for which they're treating, all of these conditions are chronic in nature, you would try as a nurse practitioner to go from the least, you know, invasive or use of medication or control substances with therapeutic means of controlling pain, other Schedule II medications that have been discussed here um, before getting to um, therapeutic marijuana. Although now we have approved it for this and, and we know that it's beneficial in all these conditions for the chronic pain that goes along with them. You know, I think I think with the bills that we passed, you know, the two things so far that we, you know, we did intend uh, to allow telemedicine and now we're hearing maybe there's some roadblocks to that and we did intend to have nurse practitioners be able to recommend medical marijuana and we know that mar medical marijuana is, it, I know it, everyone knows it's a scheduled drug. I mean, again, we're doing all this gymnastics, I call it, to try to get medicine to people because the federal government won't take it out of Schedule One, which they should do. But any patient that a, a nurse practitioner is treating, they they have a collaborative practice agreement with a physician who has recommendation authority. There is no reason at all for that to stop. We're going to give them the ability to have their own, you know, recognized recommendation ability. But in the meantime, their collaborating physicians have that ability. So that.